Hi, I'm Reggie. Would you like to own a nice apartment like this? Well, with the Nintendo Switch and the price of its accessories, the place you'll be living will look a bit more like this. You're a... Blade? No, I'm a girl. Never seen a girl before. Now that you have come this far, there can be no turning back. You and that sword. I told you I'm a girl. Oh, when did this get in my hand? Oh, put it in my mouth. When I found out that Nintendo Switch is being accepted by video game fans from all over the world as a home console that could be taken with you anywhere, I felt so relieved. Ooh, I'm really so relieved, folks. I thought this was such a dumb idea. I mean, who comes up with this shit? Oh, thank you for accepting our console. Hi, I'm Pokemon Man. I'm here to announce that we're bringing Pokemon to the Switch. And it's Pokemon Tournament! Haha, <laughs> psych! Gotcha again! Actually, we're developing a full on Pokemon RPG for the Switch. Those leaks weren't all wrong. Come on! Nice! They're making a new Metroid! Fuck, it's a Prime! Koei Tecmo, Omega Force, Team Ninja, alright. What are they turning into Dynasty Warriors now? Ah, it's just Fire Emblem. Wait, this ain't new. What's this game? Dinosaurs? What? Mario? I'm gonna take over your mind, frog. Yes, get in my mouth. Now I'm inside you, frog. Come on. For real though, Xenoblade Chronicles 2 is a bit more cartoony than the previous game, which some people are gonna like, others are gonna dislike. I'll say the English voices for this don't sound great, but then again, I'm not a big fan of Xenoblade, so I'll let the fans discuss this one. A new Kirby game is alright in my book. This looks really good. Pokemon Tournament, this ain't new. But a new Pokemon RPG is. Finally, they're announcing one for the Switch. Kind of. They said they're making one. It's coming out any day. Or any year. No footage for Metroid Prime 4, just another announcement, I guess. I don't think they were ready to announce this stuff. I've had enough of these Dynasty Warriors adaptations, so making Fire Emblem, which is a series that I, I've never really been invested in, is of no interest to me. The Legend of Zelda DLC is bringing a lot of quality of life stuff, and I think it could improve a game that's already a masterpiece. Awesome stuff. There's that Rabbids game again. <laughs> what a crazy idea, right? I'm into it. Rocket League is coming to the Switch. I only own it on three platforms so far. Might as well make it a fourth. They really need a way to transfer the DLC and rank between platforms. And Super Mario Odyssey. This game looks so weird. And I want all of it. I want all the weird. Possessing different enemies looks like such an awesome mechanic. The different environments look great too. All of it. This seems like a proper ass Mario game. And that's it, folks. That's all the press briefings for E3 this year. If you missed Sony yesterday, check out this video right here. We'll be back with more E3 videos tomorrow. My name's Globku. Thanks for watching. Boy.